I just wanted to talk about my experience uh, studying and living in the Netherlands and studying in the university and studying information technology. That's what I'm doing right now. I'm a second year student in the University of Applied Science. And I just wanted to tell you guys my experience and tell you guys how I feel about this program. Um, the f it's pretty easy, you know, um, in terms of the workload. It's not exactly in, in insane amount of workload. Like every term you get a couple exams and then if you pass or fail, um, if you fail, then you get another chance. So you get two tries each, 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 each for each exam, you get two different, two tries. And for each term you have tests. And then for each term you have classes that you attend and then you pass those classes by passing the test or you do assignments. And then you get credits at the end of each test when you pass. And then as you keep going, your credits accumulate. And then if you have enough credits at the end of the year, you have 45 credits. If you have 45 credits, then you proceed to the second year. Once you're in the second year, then you need to have 40 credits to proceed to the third year. Once you proceed to the third year, that's typically the year that you do the internship. Once you, then that, And then when you're doing the internship, you apply your skills in the real life and you try to understand how things work in real life. And you try to bring your skills to the marketplace and you try to understand that. And that kind of opens your eyes to the experience that you can get working in the workplace and working with different people, blah, blah, blah. And you don't typically get paid to do an internship. It's free. So it's kind of like, okay, what is the point? You're not really getting paid. So they, they can't expect too much of you if you're not, if they're not paying you. So when you're in an internship, I don't know how it works because I'm not in an internship. I don't do, I don't have an internship, but when you're in an internship, you typically, um, you typically don't get paid and they actually overwork you. The workload's pretty high and they oh, they don't pay you and the workload's pretty high. So they tend to take advantage of your skill set and they try to make you do lots of things even though you're not getting paid, I guess. You get paid in experience. That's your that's your pace that's your salary. You get paid in experience, which I think is bullshit. I feel like people should get paid for their job. They get they get they should get paid for a work. If I'm not getting paid at an internship, why should I do the work? Why should I put all of my effort, all of my time and sweat and tears into this project? If you guys are telling me to, okay, now we want you to create this website for this custom plate for, for this, for this customer, a custom website that is going to be e-commerce. You have to make it with HTML and CSS and JavaScript. You got to use JavaScript for the animations. Then you got to add some type of SQL database on there so that the client can be very safe when they put their information in blah, blah, blah. Then you got to use encryption. Then you got to do this and this. It's like, I'm doing all of this for you for free and I'm not getting anything out of it. But anyways, that's the internship. And then the fourth year you do a little project and then you do your thesis and that's it pretty much. It's over. It's like that. Just like that. You got to get all of the credits at the end of the four years. You got to get 240 credits. What? Is that the mosquito? Huh? Let me kill that little motherfucker. Oh, that's funny. I mean, I mean, I had to. I had to do that. You know, I'm sorry, guys, but I had to, man. Like that little motherfucker was probably gonna suck on my blood tonight, man. She, I gotta take him out before he takes me out. Hey, I'm going to be checking for that little motherfucker to see if he's dead or not. Like, for real. Um, do I have any experience building websites? I mean, I know I have to make a landing page. I have basic skills in HTML and CSS. C Sharp, I'm not really good at that. <laughs> I'm really bad at C Sharp, man. I'm really bad at the syntax. And I just, I'm not good at it. You know, console.write line, console.read line. Private static void main arg and all those arguments and array arrays and fucking if statements, for loops, while loops and stuff like that. Abstract. It's like, okay, I got to learn all this. It's so annoying. It's so difficult, man. It's not easy learning programming, man. It's so difficult. Now, the more resources you have, the easier it's going to be to... Um, 
to learn how to program. But I guess I'm making excuses, but at the same time, bro, like the more money you have, the easier it is. Your path is a lot easier because you have, you can hire a tutor if you get behind, if you go behind in your classes, you can hire a tutor outside of class. Um, you probably have a good laptop so you can like work on it at home and stuff like that. And you don't have to work on it at school. But that's the truth of the matter. You know, that's how it feels. That's how it is. Oh, yes. And what else? What else do I want to talk about? Um, it's very deep. I mean, it's very bullshit. Like the whole atmosphere in the classes and stuff like that. And it's like a bureaucracy, man. Like people, mm, it's bullshit. It's bullshit. It's bullshit. You know, some people are going to like you more than others. Other people won't like you. Some people won't like you. Some people will like you. Some people are going to be friends with you. Some people are going to try to befriend you. Some people are going to try to talk to you. Some people are not going to try to talk to you. Um, that's not the case. I mean, it's just like, you know, there's still popularity and all that bullshit. Like, come on, man. You know, it's like, who gives a fuck about popularity? Who gives a fuck about all of those things, man? Like, we're here to... We're here to get a degree and we're here to learn and get a diploma, dude. We're not here to make friends. Like, it's not, that's not what I'm here for. I'm not here to make friends with you, dude. I'm here to get a degree at the end of this course and for me to get a job. That's what I'm here for. Well, not really. I'm not going to get a job. I'm going to work for myself. But yeah, because an employer, if they don't like you, they can just fire you like that. Like that. And your and your and your livelihood, you're depending on this motherfucker for your livelihood, dude. Like you're depending on him for all of your life. You're depending on him to give you everything that you want. Come on, man. That's just stupid. Working a job is stupid. I just I mean I'm sorry. I know a lot of you motherfuckers work jobs, so I'm not making fun of you. I'm not trying to be self-righteous. You guys made your own path and you guys have to live with that, but I just don't think it's for me. You know, I just don't think it's for me. Like every job that I've had, I somehow just get, I just somehow can't do it and I quit or I get fired. And that just tells me that I'm not made for working for someone else. It's just not me. I'm, I just can't do it. Honestly, to be honest, I just, I, I can't, I can't do it. I can't work for someone else and sit there and take, and take orders from a boss. And he's going to tell me how much I'm getting paid and I have to rely on him for promotions and rely on him for more money and rely on him for all of these things. No, man, I'm good. I'll make my own way in life. I'll be my own boss. It's all bullshit. You got to play the game. I don't want to play the game. I don't want nothing to do with the bureaucracy of trying to make it in the workplace and backstabbing people, lying to people, shaming them and all this bullshit. And then you got to change your image. You got to cut your hair because you got to fit in with the workplace. There's dress codes. You can't wear whatever you want and blah, blah, blah. Bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. You get controlled in every aspect of life. Your job, the, the government controls everything you do outside of the market. It's all bullshit, man. It's just bullshit, bullshit, bullshit.